Well, welcome. Uh, I just put a video up showing uh, arterial and vein blood and, and, and some mud fossil tissues. This is the same area. I'm doing a video because I can't believe this. Right in front of my eyes, I have two layers of interstitium. I never realized it this whole time. I'm showing you this angle because everything's laying this way. The, bi the, uh, the layers of biology are laying at this, uh, this angle right here. Right in here is where I just showed you some interstitium. Well, right over here is another layer, a complete layer in the fabric right down here. Let me show you real quick. It's right over there in the corner, right there. And I'll show you here, and uh, where I just showed you was a layers right in there. Right in here. Two layers separating this biology, upper layer and a lower layer of interstitium, which there should be. This proves 100% that this is not geological. How, how did all these balls form in both those layers and in this, bio, this biology in between? A whole layer of balls here and a whole layer of them here. You understand what I'm saying? How? Let me show you something. Whoops. Sorry. A whole layer of them. A layer of them here and a layer of them here. How did those layers and hundreds of balls, how did they form like that? And then it's this separating the two. You understand what I'm saying? This is, this is below the skin, by the way. All this sandstone stuff, this is the upper layer skin. Let me show you something real quick. There's that lower layer of interstitium still in the matting, still in the fabric right here. I'm going to fly my drone over this here pretty soon. I'm going to head down there in about a month and fly my drone over this. This whole layer is interstitium below this biology here. You understand? Hundreds of these little balls with straps in them right here. And the rest is all eroded and gone. Okay? Here's the video I just put up yesterday. Here's that layer of interstitium balls right through here, okay? This whole thing is a layer of interstitium balls right through here. You can see them in here. I've show I've, I've had them in my video. Here's some um, here's one of them right here showing. Here's another one here, another one here, another one here. One barely popping out here, one here, one here. This is a layer of interstitium, okay? And you see the center on that ball, that interstitium? It don't have a nucleus like a crab or a shellfish or something on concretions that they call concretions because this is not a concretion. If this was a concretion, it would have a different center and a different nucleus than it has right there. I've showed this over and over and over again. They do not understand concretions. This is not geological. This is biological. And I'm not in a bad mood. I'm in a great mood. <laughs> now, here's another shot of that interstitium layer, the lower level. See it out there? That's the other layer. That's the lower layer. The one I just showed you just a second ago was the upper layer. And all this biology, about 30 feet of it, I can figure, in between the two. Okay? And that's the way it should be. See, that's the way in your body. Interstitium above, interstitium below, separating. So, there you go. 100% that this is not geological. Let me show you a concretion. There's one of the balls with the nucleus, the center showing. See that center? You will, that's not a crab or a clam or a crustacean or nothing like that that was formed around and then it, because that's what a concretion is, a geological concretion. You'll have a crab or a clam or something like that in the center and a, with a nucleus and all this formed around it. These don't have that. You'll never ever find those in the interstitium balls or tendon balls. You'll never find that. Okay, there's a geological concretion with a clam in there. Sir. That's the only one that's actually geological. The ones that have a clam or a crustacean or something in the center of a, for a nucleus. Those are the only ones that are a geological process. That's it. All these concretions you see there, every single one of those are biological. You will not find a clam or a crustacean or nothing in the center of any of these. Absolutely none of them. Because they are not geological process. Okay? They are a biological process. And you'll never find them ever being formed on Earth. So I'm going to end the video right there. That is biology also. And that is not a geological concretion. It's a biological tendon ball. Have a great day. Bye-bye now. Here's where I want to show you where you got the red blood, arterial blood, and you got the black vein blood above it up here, okay? You've even got some black vein blood over here in the corner. There you go, bam, there's your red arterial blood and there's your black vein blood right there, okay, where they should be, close to each other. This is not a sedimentary deposit with geological uplift. This is biology. Man, oh man, quite a debris field. <laughs> All this stuff used to be that stuff.
and it's all eroded and gets turned into sand and these bigger boulders. <sighs> okay. As you can see what we're walking on here. This is biology. Yeah, I tried to get up on there and get my camera look straight across. I think I got Got a layer underneath that taffany layer of something here. Look at this, I just noticed. Right underneath, oh, this is gonna be slick, I'll bet. Yeah. Right underneath this is that. See this layer underneath it? This layer is underneath that layer. Oh, boy, that fell over backwards there. I was wanting to maybe get up on there. I can walk on that inner stitch over there, but I don't know if I can get across that one layer there Whew. boy look how this stuff just sits on there that piece there gets slide right off and then it becomes it gets ground up it becomes sand on the beach which is skin we walk on ground up and i am not going to step on that that big old crack along there too. Yeah. I'm gonna have you a little bit. Yeah. Hmm. Love to get out on that. But I need to get back oh back up and go around and get it back over in there because I believe that's where I seen hair. Or at least all the air stitching. All right. I'll get to the camera and get a view of that. You know, if I <laughs> stand in here right beside me, look at this. That's what's right here. This is a, a separation. That's blood in there. That would have been blood flowing through this part here to service whatever this tissue is. I believe. Got another layer there. But look at all this. Oh, they're just sedimentary deposits. The hell they are. Here's a better view of that other layer. You can see where it stops and starts. I showed you from this side. And you can also see, well, you can actually see through it right here. There's not any side of it. I just showed you this a minute ago, but you can actually see how thick it is. It's just another layer. And you can absolutely see, without a doubt, that it's not a sedimentary deposit. <laughs> Look at that. Isn't that something? I'm going to get this interstitium that's in this fat, in this layer skin. How big those are. Well, I don't like standing underneath this. See that red sandstone, that old red sandstone? That's blood. That there is blood. Fossilized, mud fossilized blood. I'm not joking. Okay.